And this is Tom McGinnis to punt it away for the Tar Heel. Coined at the 30. Scoots to the far side. He'll get 10, maybe 11 on the return. And Collins, the wide receivers here. Here's Armstrong on the move. Shoots it for Concepcion. Inside the Tar Heel 25 and a Wolfpack first down at the 22. Checks to the left and Concepcion is the quarterback with the inverted wishbone. And here he goes on the keeper to the right side and wrapped up and dropped at the 18. It'll be a gain of four, 33 yard try. And the kick is away from Narvison and it is good. But they have split the last 12 meetings in Raleigh. Chapman at the goal line. Here comes the rookie. And he got hit at the 15 and no more. Feels like they're on the football field a lot. Here's May. Hands to Amarian. Hampton who breaks free. Hampton out to the 35-yard line. Takes the stop for the Wolfpack. And this is a great sign for Carolina because I think it just kind of was hard for Carolina to hold their water during them. Wolfpack only rushed three. May slipped as he reached the back of the drop. Now will tuck and run and then fumbled the ball. It popped out. And NC State has recovered. With the start from his football team's quarterback draw, something Carolina does a lot of in these third and long situations. And that ball's out. I also go back to the beginning of that, which I think has certainly helped the offense and helped the team's success. Third and a half dozen. Armstrong quick throw here on the near side. It's Porter Rooks inside the 20. Rooks is 12th catch of the year. I'm like a broken record on this. Just look at the defender lose his footing. I mean, it's Carolina players that are on the ground. And it's Porter Rooks. And they draw Demarcus Jones into the backfield with Armstrong. Here is Jones. Our beg your pardon, it's Raphael 20, not 28 Jones. And he'll reach a first down. It'll be first and goal for NC State. 41-yard try for Narvison. Hit earlier from 32 and a half. Kick is away. And it is good. In their third possession. Little delay and Hampton trying to find some room. And there's Wilson with the hit. Pack only brings three. May trying to find a crease. Will get to the 45. Took a hit from Scott. He'll be five shy of the first down. Dropped a hammer on that run by Raphael. And here's the direct snap. Concepcion trying to turn the corner. He'll get to the 35. It'll be a first down for NC State. And this is just an inside ISO play. And it's again Amara Campbell trying to blow it up. And then because of that, Concepcion just bounces it. To become this much of a factor in the football game. I would agree. Here's Armstrong to keep on the fake to Mims. And Brennan will step out of bounds, but I think he's short. And Mims with Armstrong. They're going to hand to Mims, and he will get the first down on third and short to the 48. He does a good job of identifying his talent. Here's a perimeter throw, and the catch is made, and that's Anthony Smith picking up the first down. He's now had a catch in each of the last five games. Here's a running back. They're going to toss it to him on the boundary side. Now here comes the reroute, and he can't keep his feet. Heck of a play. Armstrong shoots it inside, and Raphael makes the catch. Third and the full 10. Armstrong wants to take the shot. Does. Caught. 25-yard line, Rosner. The transfer from Rice, huge third down conversion, 19 yards. Great job of Brendan Armstrong, starts to his left, works his way all the way back to his right, and then just delivers a strike. As you see, kind of the stumble coming out of the break by Rosner. Concepcion in the backfield with Armstrong. Here's a little reverse, Keon Lassane with a block in front from Penix, and he will dive toward the 11. It'll be enough for another NC State first down. Delbert Mims in the backfield with Armstrong. To the end zone. Caught. KC Concepcion. 
the run action here. See the linebacker step up, and then the quickness of the hands of Armstrong to get it in for a score, and the Wolf Pack off to a great start. The state has dominated, winning two straight and five of the last seven headed into tonight. Armstrong rips it to Concepcion, fights through the traffic, turns the corner, keeps his feet at the 20, and Biggers finally gets him on the ground at the 11. In terms of how they're defending KC Concepcion, basically you got inside leverage on an in-breaking route, but Will Hardy, even with the leverage, just gets spun up. That's Raphael going to the boundary at the right. Here's Armstrong. Pocket collapses. Here he goes straight ahead. He'll slide inside the five. They're going to call it the six. It'll be third down and about four from there. Concepcion in motion. Slipped. Here's Armstrong to the freshman. Touchdown. Well, Concepcion, he nearly loses his footing. But it's Brennan Armstrong being able to get all of that organized and then get the ball snapped before Travis Shaw could go down to get the officials to stop the game for an injury. Disaster for Carolina offensively. First down, shot to Lassane off the arm of Armstrong. Right at about 17 yards, I think, or so for NC State on the play. Concepcion did go to his knees when he reached the bench area a moment ago. So Porter Rooks in motion there. And here's Armstrong looking to make a throw downfield. It's caught. And Keon Lassane inside the 20, thrown back by Don Chapman. One more time. Crossing route. This is Porter Rooks. Tackled around the 10-yard line by D.J. Jones. Right at 28 yards. And the kick is good. May in the Tar Heels. From the pocket, loops it for Jones, who makes the catch. And Carolina's going to have their first snap in plus territory. Harold to J.J. Jones. And they need a bunch combination. They run a corner route. Simple concept, and it's well read. It's definitely something that Carolina wants to get to. May pumps. Now wants to run with it and has some real estate. Out of bounds at the 20. That's another first down, about 15 yards there, Tim. Walker to the bottom of the screen. Going left. Throws, end zone. Copenhaver caught it. Touchdown, Carolina. Best possession for Mac Brown's team by a long shot. And this is a ridiculous throw. He's trying to get Nesbitt in the flat. Doesn't like it. And moving to his left, that's a really difficult. And Keon Lassane is deep here. And here's Lassane off the goal line. Out to the 20 and near the 25 where NC State's going to get started. Chilly night in Raleigh. This is Raphael picking up right at about five on first down. See Mitchell, the tight end, in motion. Here's Armstrong. Pump fake. Now going to sail it back near side. And Rosner reached for it. He's ruled out of bounds. Over 275 yards after the grab there here in the opening frame. Here's Lassane working off a block. And I think that was Penix who tried to help him across midfield with the hedge and did. Third and less than a yard. Yep. Third and short, and here's Mims. He's the short yardage back, and he got a long yardage there. Past his history, here's Delbert Mims tonight, guys. Got to be careful where you have breakfast. <laughs> here's Armstrong from the pocket again, able to step through and slide down. There's a bit of a story here. For NC State, if you can pick up the first down. Around the corner, Raphael will pick up the first down. Dave Doran. If you're Brennan Armstrong, you probably need to be working the sideline. Armstrong throws. That's caught. That's Dakari Collins inside the five. That's another first down. That's too close for comfort for me. Armstrong to throw. End zone shot. Caught. Concepcion. He's not in now, so he's, he's got a mayday field goal, and you got to fly to do it. And here they go. And I'm not really sure why it's untimed.
and the kick is good. So pistol for Armstrong with Concepcion who gets the carry to the right side and will pick up eight, almost nine on first down of that first half. Here is Armstrong shooting it across the field. Keon Lassane the catch. He'll slip down shy of midfield at the 49. Snapped Armstrong. Quick throw, near side. This is Collins, the Clemson transfer. And Dakari Collins brought down by Marcus Allen. It'll be a first down to the Carolina 40 on a 13-yard throw. Concepcion in the barrel of the pistol with Armstrong. And here's the give to the freshman. Working to the right side. He'll turn the corner. He's got 10, 15, about 18 yards on first down. Marcus Allen, the tackle of Kevin Concepcion. Look at the movement that these guys get. Outside zone. Look at the uh, Concepcion's four yards past the line of scrimmage before he really makes Armstrong on the third and long play. Lob for the end zone. Collins there. Caught it. Dakari Collins and an NC State touchdown. Armstrong sees it. You got an all-out pressure. Pressure inside and then man across the board. will take your shot, your best matchup. He chooses the press coverage at the bottom of the screen and throws an absolute strike. The Wolfpack continue to put points on the board. First in the ACC and third national. Jones, a diving catch out at the 31 for a pickup of six. Marion Hampton can't get going. The run pursuit tonight by the Red Shirts has been terrific, Tim, and that's Peyton Wilson there. Tonight, Carolina's got just 63 yards after that, and here goes May taking off. Flag thrown behind the play. Drake May breaks free. 30, 25, 20, and he'll ease out of bounds ahead of Aiden White around the 15, but this may be coming back. Wow, it was interesting. And that's a good call there. You see the hand up on Spencer Rollin. I thought inside... Look at Willie Lampkin. It actually looks like C.J. Clark maybe just slips and falls. And Lampkin. Here's May on second down. He'll keep it to the left side. Drake inside the five to the one. Big lick from Boykin. Third down here. Tario's right at the line. May going to dodge to the left and fall into the end zone. So Drake May's got his ninth rushing score of the year. And the Tar Heels take the opening possession of the second half and put some points on the board and then all of a sudden a couple of yards here on the dive and Carolina within 20. Mims will start with Armstrong on the series. Concepcion's in a slot to the top and Armstrong to throw hit as he does loops it for KC caught 45 yard line trying to make a move he'll cross the field and here he goes 35 30 and fumbled the ball biggers knocked it loose and carolina fell on it at the 22 i believe inbounds really hot here with this call and i gotta be honest unless they're saying he drove him into the ground he, he's not leading with the crown of his helmet his helmet is off to the side it's his shoulder in the midsection I don't believe that's roughing the passer. Will draw up as the quarterback. And he will keep it left side. Trying to get a block here at the corner and out of bounds around the five. 176 yards of total offense so far. And here's the handoff to Mims. And the big fellow will drive into the end zone. Touchdown, NC State. And it's his eighth rushing score of the year. It's a really nice cut, too, because Cayman Rucker comes flying in. It's kind of slicing underneath his original path. It's a good job of bouncing it, and then good strength on the finish by Mims to take e BJ, or excuse me, Giovanni Biggers into the end zone. Yep, looking forward to a fantastic environment next Saturday night in Charlotte. Off the 25, May launches, and that's caught. One of the biggest hits of the night. Yep. May pumped it. Now trying to get through. Oh, my goodness. He scooped it out to Hampton, who will get the first down, I believe, to the Wolfpack 42. Caden Fordham was there for NC State. 
And third and ten. State bringing the house again. May shoots it middle of the field. That's caught. Right along the uh, hash mark at the near side. Bryson Nesbitt flags that down. With British Brooks in the backfield. A little shovel pass to Brooks. Trying to ride some blockers inside the 25. Brooks down near the 20. It'll be another Carolina first down. Second and 10. May. Here's Walker at the 10, the 5, and Tez Walker. Did he break the line for the touchdown? Sean Brown the hit, and no signal yet. Now a touchdown's been awarded to the Tar Heels and Tez Walker. Well, it's a great effort by Tez Walker, by Drake May. All kinds of room to run afterwards. And then there was a big collision there by Brown. And I think that was Peyton Wilson. Ball came out. But then it's recovered, I think, in the end zone by Tez, unless that knee was down before the ball came out. Raphael and Poole in the backfield, and this is Kendrick Raphael, who picks up about four on first down. You don't know where he's going to line up. Here's May off the nine, shooting for Walker. Or Jones, beg your pardon, and the hit made by Battle on J.J. Jones, who's still down. Jones shaking up. And he takes a pretty good shot by Battle right in the back. Jones, who was a little shaken up on the previous drive, which is why we were seeing some of the reserve receivers. Like maybe that left arm. Yep. Here's May. Shooting for Copenhagen, the catch out of bounds at the Tar Heel 45. You know, I think he's got to get some of it back, go for it on fourth down. Here's May. He will hold and now throw to Copenhagen and a first down at the Wolfpack 40. 20 yards or more off the line of scrimmage. He's going to slip it to Brooks, try to ride his blockers across midfield. And there's Wilson out of the air to take him down at the Wolfpack 49. Back to a 19 point lead. And Kendrick Raphael hurdles a guy, and he'll be about four or five yards short of the first down. I don't think that that's going to stop now. He brings the corner on this one. Here's May. Hit as he throws, and it's caught at the 43-yard line. That's Bryson Nesbitt. Tony Gibson wasn't lying. They bring the corner from the bottom of the spring. Screen. 43. Here's Brooks in the backfield with May. And British will make the catch, and then... Guess who? 11 was there, and so was Devon Betty for the Wolfpack. May thought about it. Tucks and runs. First down. Montalus for the first down. Throw Copenhagen the catch. And another Carolina first down. Yeah, for I the think, 19. And we've seen NC State play soft a few times. Carolina's got Nesbitt, Jones, and Copenhagen to the left. Walker to the right, the throw for Tez Walker. Intercepted, Peyton Wilson. It kind of oozes inside to it. See how he just kind of stops? That allows Aiden White to close on and gets his hand in there. And not all that different than some plays we've seen earlier this year because of hustle to the football. Peyton Wilson's there. Cold tub on a cold night. Mims in the backfield. That's Rooks in motion. And double Mims will fall across the 20. Starts from its 39. And May being pressured, sacked by Wilson. The ball came out, and it looked like Lampkin fell on it, but a marker down on the play, and Drake May shaking up. Injury, another look here, Tim. Well, it was Copenhaver trying to block Peyton Wilson, which... On a pass rush, it's probably not what you want. I think the ball is down, and I, I just think it, I mean, that ankle as actually expecting to play coverage here on third and long. Snap to Harrell, and sacked he is. That is Red Hibbler. Rollins, the right side of your screen, he's just coming up the field and he's able to get the edge quickly. Rollin, who just has a hard time getting out of his stance, and no shot for Harrell. 
There's Armstrong, and this is Lassane, and he'll get the first down to the Carolina 46. Third down. Armstrong wants to throw, and he'll be sacked. Back. Congratulations to Jerry Hahn, who, Tim, 34 years ago, and was in 34 years, Jerry Hahn has done a first-class, first-rate job for the Wolfpack fans. A wonderful gentleman. We wish him all the best, and congratulations on having a night here for your final football game at Carter Finley with a terrific night for NC State. And congratulations to Gary. Here is British Brooks. Carolina with a second down play. We'll pick up a first down with 2.28 to play. And now May. Underneath again to Brooks. And Peyton Wilson makes the tackle at the 45. He has eight games with 10 or more this season. He had 16 against Miami this year. And there is Nesbitt. And almost or was intercepted. The deflection comes away, and Devin Boykin has got his fourth career interception and his third of the year. Three turnover night, a fumble, and two interceptions. And this one, kind of high and behind Nesbitt. Probably should make the play, but tips and overthrows in the middle of the field. How about this? Typically turn into interceptions. Bishop Fitzgerald or Devin Boykin? One of them had it, and it was Boykin. And the Wolfpack are going to go to nine and three. Winners of five straight and six of six. I think means a lot in terms of when you get your opportunity again to come back and play well, which he certainly has done. And here is Mims breaking free and can't keep his feet. What a night for Kevin Concepcion, Brennan Armstrong, and Dave Doyle. And NC State. Because Tim at three and two, this could have gone either way after five weeks.